This is the worst overall team in the NFL. And for every touchdown I score in their week one game, I get to add a 99 overall player to the team. It doesn't matter how we score, we just gotta find one way or another to get this ball into the end zone. And I legitimately have to find a way to score as many touchdowns as possible. I'll explain why he dropped this in just a second. Bro, can I please get this first down at least? Oh, thank God, OJ Howard hung on to it. We've gotta score as many touchdowns as possible because following this game, I I'm simulating to the playoffs, and if I haven't built a good enough team to at least make the playoffs, I've got to spend my hard-earned money on a Texans jersey and wear it in my videos for an entire week. Like, look at how bad this team is, dude. I'm going to literally need every 99 overall player in the game, and that still might not be enough to bring us to the playoffs. Damian Pierce, just please don't fumble. Oh, great, bro. Like, we need flags. And this is even harder than it seems. Not only is this game on the hardest difficulty possible, I have bumped all my sliders down 10 each and increased my opponents by 20. This is gonna be like playing an opponent in the freaking Madden Classic. Like, this is literally gonna end up being one of the hardest challenges in the history of the channel. How am I supposed to pick this up? We really need an open man. We have an open man. We have an open man. He caught Oh my god. Oh my god. Keep the freaking change rolling, boys. Oh, please. Again. Again. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Thank you. Hopefully that first drop was just an anomaly. We can't get this close and not score. We might not get many chances. Oh my god. That was actually a dime. A perfectly led pass. And just like that, dudes, we get to add our first 99 overall to the team. I think for starters, we have got to upgrade this defense. Like, it is so bad, dude. A 73 overall defense, which is easily the worst in the entire league. We need somebody that can affect the quarterback. And I know of just the guy. Aaron Donald is now a Houston Texan. And oh my gosh, that already looks so much better. As of now, Aaron Donald and Jerry Hughes isn't a bad one-two punch to try and get after the quarterback. If we do get another upgrade, I think I'm gonna have to try and improve this offense. We need players that can just take over a game. Now, I'm glad we scored in all, but we're only on pace to score four touchdowns this entire game. And you thought the stakes were already high? There are currently four members of the 99 club, and if I don't end up scoring at least four touchdowns and adding all four members to the team, I have to dis card every last one of their mutt cards. I don't want to waste coins, dude. We're in the midst of a back strike. Now, if I play the game of my life and actually score more than four touchdowns, I then can start adding 98 overalls, which would be ideal because this team needs everything it can get. Bro, the Colts keep going on these long sustained drives and all they're doing is wasting time. Like, obviously, I'd like to win this game because we need to make the playoffs, but it isn't absolutely necessary and like thank god it's not oh please oh please that is horrible that is freaking disgraceful david we need lasers we actually need lasers we get lasers bro they cannot cover the seams for whatever reason like remember their pass coverage and reaction time is up to 70 let's just be smart be smart be smart david run david run david go fast david don't fumble the problem is too our fumble slider took a hit so like we could literally fumble on any given play there's just so many obstacles that we're gonna have to overcome today but i do have faith <laughs> maybe i shouldn't bro a field goal does us no good and hopefully no way no way we just got another flag called against us rough in the passer bite me Bite me. Match fixing. God dang it, Laramie. I'm quickly becoming a four vertical merchant and I really don't care. Please catch this. Oh my god, he actually hung on. You actually hung on. You absolute legend, bro. Keep dropping dimes, David. Keep freaking dropping dimes, bro. Just dump it off. Damian Pierce, don't fumble. Don't fumble. Thank you so much. Max is so worried about completing this. We're just gonna hand this ball off. Damian Pierce, oh my god, the run blocking is just apparent that it sucks. I say that, I'm kind of too scared to throw the ball in this situation, so we're gonna hand it off again. I think we got it. I think we got it. It's gonna be first to go, boys. We need this so badly. He's so open. Let's get ourselves another 99 overall player added to the Houston Texans, cause boys, we all know that I need it. Imagine me in a Texans jersey. Like it just wouldn't feel right.
The defense has already been improved, so I think now it's only right to try and improve the offensive side of things. And we're just dying for somebody to give the ball to, and we need a big play. And I have a decent idea. Welcome to Houston, Devontae Adams. And look at that. Now Davis Mills has Devontae Adams, Brandon Cooks to throw to, not to mention Nico Collins, a decent option, can run the ball with Damian Pierce. Devontae Adams, a 100% welcome addition. Next so, like, this defense, it still just needs so much work to even be close to playoff caliber. So I gotta grind for another touchdown so I can make this better. Please, a quick stop. Oh my god, dude, our defense is freaking horrible! 46 seconds to score a freaking touchdown. This is disgraceful. Like, we are barely barely on track to complete the challenge and save my mud coins and ideally i want to get more than five players added to the team dude we need everything we can get oh my god this if we can get some blockers oh i forgot bro i forgot your freaking iq ratings probably bumped down as well smart decisions smart decisions smart decisions Honestly, thinking about it, wasn't a smart decision. I, I I forgot. There's 20 seconds left. Moron. The score here is really gonna take an absolute miracle, and uh, now so even more. Like, do I hope and pray for some sort of like pass interference call, or is that like kind of seen as immoral? Oh, put your hands up. Well, a punt is definitely not what I had in mind there. We're gonna have to have ourselves a much better second half. I just don't wanna have to waste my money on one of these ugly jerseys. We do get the ball though, to start the second half here, and that's always a plus. I mean, we've done fine given our restrictions and given the challenge, but like we just haven't gotten the ball back. We can't do anything about our defense suck. Boys, we have a fourth down and three, and you best believe I am freaking going for this. Please, bro, please, bro. We didn't get it. We actually didn't get an oh to my god. Oh my god. Defense stands strong, please. Oh my god, they actually did. Oh please, oh please, oh please. I, I really got scared. Like I actually thought that was the end of the world there. I'm so impatient when it comes to Madden. Oh my god, can we fit that in? We did, we did, bro. That's why I'm impatient, because we have Davis Mills back there dropping dimes. Oh, I see you, I see you. Please, get in, get in. We're so close, bro. There's no way we choke this. There's no way we choke our third 99-rated player. Truth or dare, I pick dare. And he's gonna get himself into the end zone. Dare Ogunbowale. Who? I don't care who you are. You just gave us another 99 rated player. The offense is looking so much better, but I think for our third edition, we have got to go back to the defensive side of the ball. Another guy we gotta add to the squad that can just get to the quarterback and just take over games. Get over here! Miles Garrett now back in Texas and opposing quarterbacks are gonna be fearing for their lives. How in the world are offensive lines supposed to block this. It is kind of funny looking at this though because like they just look so out of place. But I'm definitely glad they're on our squad. And we gotta keep pressing for more because this offense still needs more. Defense quick stop. One three and out. Oh my god, I swear they pick up every freaking third down to score your touchdown, bro. We're in the fourth quarter already. Oh my god, can we just please at least get the bare minimum and avoid just throwing away my hard-earned mutt coins? Like, there's, like, so much going on right now. Like, I want to win the game, too, man, because that's important. Oh, you're wide open. Please don't drop it. Thank you so much, dude. It's really weird how we, like, dropped the very first pass at them. But, like, the receivers, they've been pretty decent since then. Oh, pretty good protection. <laughs> wide open receiver, Nico Collins. Oh, my God, dude, we're getting closer. Oh, no. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, Davis Mills, the magician. Like, keep in mind, too, dude, the touchdown would give us a lead here. It's just in stride. Oh my god, they were six yards away. And even if we score here, bro, we still have so much work to do. Please just take off. Don't you dare fumble. Don't you dare fumble. Davis Mills, the savior of our mud coins. You legend. At least that stress is off my shoulders, but bro, we still have to concentrate. We have to stay locked in. Back to the offense. And in all honesty, the weapons are perfectly fine. I just really fear for Davis Mills' life. 
Like, this offensive line is pretty freaking stinky. So thank God the next 99 rated player is an offensive lineman. One of the best tackles to ever play the game is now protecting Davis Mills' blind side. That looks so much better. And already we have taken the worst overall team in the entire NFL up to an 80 overall with an 81 offense and a 79 defense. I don't know if we have a fifth touchdown in us, but if we do, I'm kind of torn on whether or not we should add to defense or if we should keep adding to offense. Defense, just one gosh dang stop. Oh my God, we actually got one. And the smart thing would probably be to shoot clock right here, but no, bros, I want another player. I need to add as many as possible. I just don't want to stress. Oh, please. Oh, please, it's beautiful. Oh, please, it's beautiful. Not any longer. That sucks. Well, unfortunately, they just took a freaking lead. Still have plenty of time, though. Four minutes, that's enough time for a touchdown or two, maybe. Lock in, Nico. We need more. Oh, that's a pick. That's a pick six. That's a pick six. Oh, my God. That is uh, not what we needed. I, I thought about throwing a pick six before I hiked the football. And it, it, my nightmares came true. You know what, though? Just screw it. We got to continue to lock in. Put it behind us. Have a short-term memory. Oh, my gosh. Tight end open. And we threw it over his head, bro. Well, basically, this is game. I really want to pick this up, dude. We need more. And I, I, I just had to, I had to do that. I just had to do it. Well, uh, for one, boys, that's this game lost. But if they can score a touchdown rather quickly, like, yeah, the L is confirmed. We can still score ourselves another touchdown. Oh, I see you. I see you. <laughs> oh, please. That's a touchdown. That's a touchdown. That's a touchdown. Let's go. That's a fifth player we can add to the squad. And I don't even care that we're going to lose this game. I'm just glad we get one more good player. I have decided that we are going to go offense here. But which position do we actually try and upgrade? Let me tell you boys something. Patrick Mahomes is not a happy camper. Tyreek's a dolphin. Now Travis Kelsey is a Texan. It came down to either adding Nick Chubb or Travis Kelsey. See, like the tight end position was just too much of a glaring need and I have faith in Damian Pierce But what are the odds I can score another touchdown really quick because I still don't know if this is enough, dude Like imagine the scenes we actually get this onside kick. I'd be Oh my god, it was so close. Oh wow, they're actually throwing the football So um, if anything that means we get the ball back can we actually find a way to add another player? Like, honestly, that touchdown might end up being a blessing in disguise. Because Davis Mills continues to drop dimes! As I sit here and watch the Colts bring back a pick six, I've got to understand that we've added five players to the squad, and given how this team was initially, it could have gone a lot worse. Although 59 to 33 is pretty freaking bad. So we've successfully managed to go from this to this. 81 overall team, 84 offense, 79 defense, two solid tackles, insane weapons for Mills to throw to. And when it comes to the defense, it's really Miles Garrett Aaron Donald and a bunch of clowns. But I have faith, though. These two guys are going to be enough. They're both going to have career seasons and lead this defense to be a top five unit in the league. That may be wishful thinking. Everything comes down to the click of a freaking button. My fandom, my sanity, all comes down to this. I don't want to waste my money on a Texans jersey. We're in the AFC South, so it really doesn't take much to make the playoffs, and that's what we need at bare minimum. I can't take it. I actually cannot take it, dude. I don't want to waste my money. Did we really just go 10-7 and seven and not make the playoffs? Did we really just do everything I just did to actually go 10-7 and seven on the year and not make the freaking playoffs? Bro, what do you mean? What do you freaking mean? No, dude, you've got to be kidding me. This is so dumb, dude. All we had to do was win one more game. Hey, I can get a John Mechie jersey. I like John Mechie. I actually ended up a dub. If you enjoyed that one, click the video right here. I promise you guys what happens in this video, it would just completely blow your mind.